For centuries, humans have found their way on the trackless oceans using patterns of stars in the sky. Well, how will Juno find its way to Jupiter in the trackless space of space? In order to get the Juno spacecraft in orbit around Jupiter, we have to navigate it precisely in deep space. So let's say this little model represents the Juno spacecraft. And this laser pointer and these two straws represent Juno's star tracker navigation system. Cameras on board Juno look for a pattern of holiday lights in a black card. I mean, I mean, a pattern of stars in deep space. And when it recognizes the pattern that's been programmed into it by navigators here on Earth, it causes the tiny rocket motors to steer Juno precisely on course. Now, Juno doesn't want to aim right for Jupiter itself. You want to get in orbit around Jupiter. Now, notice. Even the slightest disturbance in deep space will cause Juno to miss. It will miss Jupiter, it will miss its orbit. And it will miss it by that much. Now, that much doesn't seem like much here. But in deep space, that much becomes hundreds of thousands of kilometers or miles or millions of leagues. And Juno would be gone forever, lost in space. <laughs>